Streamlined and simple yet full of comfortable features, the Osprey Skimmer 16 is the perfect day pack to carry all the water you need, plus a few extra essentials for a full day of adventure. Let's take a closer look. It does have a nice, simple, and clean design, but this pack is certainly an upgrade from a generic hydration pack. So I wanna turn it around and first point out the Osprey Hydraulics LT system here. You actually have access into your hydration reservoir from the outside. You can see there's a little H2O symbol right here at the top and a separate sleeve that you can access that hydration system. So you don't have to take anything out of your pack in order to change the water and refill your hydration system. Now this does come standard with the pack, so that's an added value. It's a two and a half liter hydration reservoir, and it's really simple and easy to use. The way they've designed it, um, you don't have the type of barreling that you've got with some other water bags. It's actually got channels on the inside that keep it from barreling out, and that makes it a lot more comfortable when it's up against your back. It's really easy to refill because um, of a handle design that they have in there. And what I really like about it is you can route the hose out either side. You can route the hose out the middle if you want. You've got stretchy bungees here on the harness and there's actually a magnetic bite valve. The bite valve's really simple and easy to use. You do have that sternum strap right there and the magnet. So that all you need to do when you're hiking or biking or whatever your adventure holds, you just put that right across and it's easy to access. Now, even though this is such a small and lightweight pack, they've got a great suspension system with the back panel and the shoulder harness. On the back panel, you just have a foam frame sheet. It's nice and breathable and they actually have channels in that foam to be really breathable, to wick away sweat. You have mesh on top of that foam. There's even a stiffener in the inside there, so it makes it a little bit more of a rigid back panel, but it's still fairly flexible. So as you're moving, this back panel is going to move with you. On the shoulder harness, I was actually really impressed by this. You've got that same foam with cutouts in it on the harness. That's gonna breathe really well, just like the back panel. And you've got plenty of padding, plenty of mesh there. And they even bring the padding all the way around so that the seam here is not in contact with you. Um, it's actually on the outside. So that's gonna cut down on any sort of chafing or bruising. So if you're moving fast on the trail, that's not gonna slow you down and that's not gonna cause any problems there. So I really like that small detail. That's gonna make a big difference. Again, you do have a sternum strap that's adjustable, so you can move that up and down to whatever height you need. There is a lightweight and very simple hip belt down on the bottom. You can actually remove that if you want to, so if you're just going out for the day, you have a really lightweight load and don't need that, you can take it off of there. But it comes in handy, especially if you're biking or bike commuting and you want the bottom of the pack to stay nice and secure there down at the bottom. Now, if I turn it to the side, you can see just simple stretch mesh pockets on both sides. Those will accommodate a 32 ounce water bottle. So they're nice and stretchy. You can store any and all types of smaller items in there to keep them nice and secure and then they're out of the way when you're not actually using that pocket. So that's something I really like. You've got compression straps on the sides. So if you don't have this pack packed out completely, you can really compress that load so that the gear on the inside isn't moving around. In the same way, you have a bungee here on the front. You can store an extra layer in that bungee or you can use that to compress the pack. Now, this is a panel loading pack. So you have one main compartment here accessed right through the top and you can just get your hands on all of your gear that you need to in that main pocket. It's just one big pocket in there, but then you have a small media pocket right here on the front. I've got a hat stored in there. Um, you've got a key clip so your keys don't get lost in the rest of the pack. And this is kind of a media friendly pocket 
you've got a nice soft fabric on the inside. So smaller items that you don't want to get lost in the bottom of the pack can be stored right up here on top. Overall, this is a really lightweight pack, but it is full of features. They didn't overbuild it. There's not too many pockets. Um, you can really use this for your full day of adventure, whether you're hiking, traveling, biking, or whatever else you can throw at it. It's the Osprey Skimmer 16 Day Pack. Thanks for watching. If you have additional questions about the gear you just saw, please feel free to visit backcountryedge.com and get in touch with me or one of our other gear specialists. We also have technical specs about that gear on the product pages of our website, and oftentimes we have bonus videos. If you like our channel, please subscribe.